Okay, here is Papa Alpha 5 Hotel Romeo and this video goes about the Acom 1010, my new one, what he has uh, arrived and I explain a little bit about the Acom 1010 and this video explains the whole power amp. Hope you enjoy the video. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up and uh, don't forget to subscribe. Seventy free. Papa Alpha 5 Hotel Romeo. So, here we see the power amp Acom 1010 from the back side, and here we see antenna outgoing to the antenna. That is uh, antenna 1. This is antenna 2. The amp have uh, two antennas, one, two. This is uh, antenna input, came from the transmitter, that is a signal input. And uh, here we see the ground, ground to the earth. 240 volt and here the switching cable for uh, switching the relay electronic uh, from uh, the transmitter that uh, the power amp goes to the transmit and here the fuse those fuse so that is the back side nothing special and you can see that here on the paper here 230 40 volt and the power switch for the transmitter the earth signal input signal output one and two that is all that is uh, the back side from uh, the power amp Acom 1010. Yeah, here we see uh, the front of the Acom 1010 and here the power switch. The Acom has one power switch and when you push this power switch the Acom will go into the uh, warming phase uh, for three minutes. Here is the antenna switch, antenna one, antenna two, RTTY switch, operate switch. But the amp uh, goes automatically in operate, and when you uh, not transmit for a long time, you can this switch off, and then the power amp will in standby mode. Here uh, we have the tune capacitor and uh, you can tune your, the antenna there and here is the load capacitor here we have the band switch the amp uh, goes from uh, 1.8 to 3.5 7 10 14 18 and 21 and 24 28 so almost the hand radio bands so here is a 4 watt power indicator, the amp does 700 to 750 watts, you can see the outgoing power here and here the reflected power, if you have reflected power you can see that here and the amp handled to maximum 250 watt back, but <laughs> that is not so very good if you have any reflected power. So here we see the indicator grid 1, grid 2, EP, OLT. And if there are a problem with your antenna there, if uh, you have uh, high SWR, you will see the faulty and or uh, you have uh, the reflected power very high, you can see the faulty LED light up. Or electrical fault, 
in this amp, grid 1, grid 2 light up. But uh, uh, yeah, that's the indicator therefore. And uh, the other indicator I have uh, said earlier is forward power, 750 watt max, and reflective power that is uh, not good when you see here any reflected power. So if you wish to tune your power amp on your antenna, it is very simple. Therefore, you have here an indicator that uh, means uh, here, this indicator, three LEDs. And left is yellow, and right is yellow, in between is green. So, and if you tune your antenna, the uh, uh, middle LED must light green. And sometimes it is possible your left or your right LED will all light up, but that is not uh, a problem but the green light must light up and then your power amp is good tuned on your antenna and how it goes i show you now before you tune your uh, power amp you have to look in this user manual from the arcom 1010 there is a table you can use it for a quick tuning tuning the power amp to your antenna that will help you to tune your power amp very fast to your antenna. So here again we see the table. You can use it. There are the presets on 160 meter band to 80 meter, 40 meter, 30 meter, 20 meter, 17, 15, 12, and 10 meters. That are the preset and the numbers what you can use for the tune and load. You see that here load knob and tune knob. And that you can find in your user manual. So now I will show you how to tune your power amp and how it goes. So first of all you have to switch on the power switch. Yes, and you will see the green light light up and the operate light is flickering. That means your power amp is in warming up. The tube is in warming up and uh, it goes almost for three minutes. Three minutes. You have to wait three minutes and when the operate light is light up and not flickering then you can tune your amp and the power the input power to tune your amp is only between 10 and 20 watts i use only 20 watts input and then you can tune very quickly and easy this power amp so now uh, the power amp is ready the warming up is ready, so you see the green light light up and it's not flickering anymore. So if you will tune this amp, you look for a free frequency and make sure there is nobody to work on this frequency, then you can tune your power amp. So first of all, you have uh, in the user manual the quick um, presets. And for 10 meters, I tune it for 10 meters now. I have uh, the load is 60. Here's the load, 60. And the tune button is 20. You see that? 20. So that is a preset. And you have to power switch to 24, 28. So here we see the power amp again and now I tune this power amp and how it goes you will see that and the uh, warming up uh, is already so and I uh, will tune on 10 meter band the power switch here the power switch here is uh, on 24 and 28 and I have uh, 
the preset set to 60 and 20 that is for 10 meters here okay and then I push the PDT and I have to switch on antenna 2 antenna 2 here is antenna 2 is uh, yellow and antenna 1 is green so you can see that here so then uh, I push the PDT and you see the amp is already tuned yes and my input power is 20 watts and uh, you can look it's a maximum power yes that is already so yeah then the power amp is tuned is very quick and very easy so that uh, is a tuning from your power amp Arcom 1010 yeah this was a clip about the Arcom 1010 and the power amplifier and the whole explaining and I hope I can help someone with this video and uh, yeah I hope we hear us on the frequencies here is Papa Alpha 5 Hotel Romeo 73